Street outside of Cruz Apothecary was Randall's first warning the devil had come calling. The second clue was the man himself leaning inside the doorway, enjoying the view. Wearing a custom-fit, tailor-made black business suit, not a single bead of sweat dared touch his skin, even though it was over a hundred degrees outside with 150 percent humidity. No doubt he was accustomed to much hotter weather, Randall mused, as he stared at the leader of Hell's Back. Built like a bull, he filled the doorway from the top of his head, brushing the entryway to his wide shoulders blocking out the light. Tossing a quick glance over his shoulder, he acknowledged Randall's presence with a nod before going back to watching the show taking place outside. It wasn't his large frame, black hair, or even his luminescent blue eyes, which couldn't possibly be human, that gave a hint to his identity. Randall gave equally little heed to the dark power radiating throughout the room. No, Randall knew Death Angelo for another reason altogether. He owned Randall's soul. Shifting his gaze to the window.